everybody, it's me. Uh, my name is Mark Rabbit, aka the Shark Rabbit, sponsored by Two DC, Eddie Des, and Syndicate Park Shop. Uh, we up in here. We're gonna take you through the fucking day in life. I'm alive. Um, you hear me? You've been riding scooters for too, too long. Fifteen? Um, less than fifteen, I would say. Ten Wait, years. Um, fifteen years, I reckon. All my life, all my life. You know me? You should not put that in, by the way. Nah, do it. You gotta do another one. Alright, we just rocked up to Nixon Skate Park. Mark Abbott, the Shark Rabbit, first try line. Hold up, let me get to my position. Watch out for the kids. No warm up. We good. Not even your scooter. Okay. New scooter. Yeah. New scooter for the occasion. <laughs> Move Lawrence! We just saw all these like street crews em emerging we are like well fuck and then we just decided yes please was like the right one and then sharks got some Yes and then another kid said please and then next sort of just clicked on Yeah and pretty then much I wasn't even on the tour but um Jasper told me about oh, the yes please don't thing Don't go left oh, though, fuck. go straight Alright so um yeah he told me about the yes please thing and then I pretty much just made the Facebook page and then from there made the group on Facebook and invited all the lads that I thought should be in the yes please crew and from there it's just taken off and pretty much Lawrence does most of the shit nowadays I've deleted Facebook so that's why you won't see me you won't see my face on there anymore but um I won't see your face on the book but I'm still out there fucking stacking we're all stacking clips and that's what it's all about like we're all mates, so it's not like, hey bro, can I get sponsored by Yes Please? Uh, yeah, nah. The footage, so you've been stacking clips for a long time. Yeah, bro, there's a big bank in there. Some dealer, man. Oh. Some mean times on your scooter, bro. Do you guys want to get food? 
Nah. I don't, but they did. Can. I mean, like, we might as well just park up for these guys. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Where are they? What a spot you've chosen to park up at. <laughs> <laughs> Happen Sharky, mate? Uh, just waiting for me boys to drive past. I'm pretty much staying on the road just so I can see them. Can we go back to near the car so we can catch them? Yeah. Otherwise, because they've got no credits, so... Uh, they're pretty much... Mine! <laughs> you bloody goddamn dirty, eh? <laughs> Searching for prices for this golf course. Because we're going to have a round of golf. And that's a day in a life. What I do every day. We are. We are. Off to the golf course to play some holes of golf. Name. So we're at Water Downs. Uh, have been here for a couple of years, few years probably now. And uh, just gonna smack this ball right down the fairway. Can you uh, just read us out the scores? <laughs> oh wow, um, Mike can do the honours. Oh, here's a feature and so the third. Who came third and on what score? Uh, in third place at the Waddle Downs Golf Club, we have Regan Thompson with uh, 71 points. Ooh, on nine holes, that's the, that's pretty good. And then uh, second place we have Michael Stables with 63 points. Ooh. And then first place we have the Shark Rabbit. With 60 points. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Pretty cool. Oh, who's, who's, who's uh, gonna hook it up with the box or a case? Pretty if you're in Australia, who's hooking up with the case? I have, mate. You, I have to give you 10 bucks on Monday, mate. Oh, mate. <laughs> pretty, pretty chuffed with yourself, aren't you, bro? Pretty fucking good round of golf. Have we got our scooters? Fucking nice summer day. No, I think they're in my We could even go to Clinton right now. My I reckon we can get some warm down clips of you today still. Mm, possible. My scooter's in Lawrence's mum's car, I think. My scooter's it's in the way. It's on the way, isn't it? No, nah, my scooter's in my car, so I'm going to Clinton. So, um, unlucky us. But, um,. No, just like, we'll just stop in there and we'll leave like within like maybe 15 minutes. Just go get some fi final clips. Yeah, for the day. that's about it. Like. Alright, signing out at Wattle Downs Golf Course. Yeah, mate. Cheers, mate. Straight, one, straight. one take. Just one take, one board. Rock one for the bros, one for the hose, and one for you. Here you go. Oh. I got faith, but I'll believe it when I see it. <laughs> um, not promising anything, but um, let's do it. Yeah, I could do that easy. Nice. <laughs> Let's have a look at that. That's beautiful, bro. And we're done. Adios, amigos. Yeah. Uh, bro, I've never touched that rail in my life, so fuck it. Come back one day with the with oh, the I HV can... Lawrence. I have no idea what I would do, man. Sun down, sun up. We're heading to the pub, and we're gonna play a game of eight game pool. 
and we're gonna have some fun. I'll be chilling and yeah, sus, sus, sus. What do you keep saying? You just keep talking shit all day, every day. Motherfucker, say the same. Motherfucker, here's a spit. Motherfucker, put in the motherfucker. <laughs> oh my lord! Uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I'm a professional shark pool player. You hear me? Oh boy, it's shaking. I don't think you can put that much swearing on Dude, YouTube. Dude, I have no idea like what you just fucking... You're still recording. I'm um, fucking gonna get a pizza. Gonna fucking get a pizza. In that vlog scenario, I just thought that like having good proper insoles makes you more efficient and less like stress because like you don't have to think about like landing on a big drop sort of thing or big stairs, big rails. If you got proper insoles, no worries, mate. No fucking worries. That's why I ride Vans Ultra Kush HD insoles. Well, there you go. And I fucking ride fucking. I can't remember. Um, FP Jaws Homoki insoles. It's not Jamo. Yeah, it's some shit. And I got the standard Janoski insoles, man. Some they shit, but it's definitely FP for sure. Make sure you go aftermarket insoles, kids. Otherwise, the standard Nike ones will fuck your ankles by the end of the your teenage the, years. The moral <laughs> of the story is like, fuck hill bruise and fuck having like. And fucking sort of shit that fucking makes you not want to ride sort of thing, so hell yeah, hell yeah. We we're here. Um yeah. Best part of the vlog is when you're trying to understand the game of poker. And poker is my favorite game and we'll play fucking golf, play pool. Now we're on to poker, and poker is like Shark. the circus game, mate. And in not that, just the game, it's a lifestyle. Eh? It's like everything above, below, and all in between, sort of thing. And I'm just gonna teach you how to play Regan Thompson. Um, okay, we'll start easy. Pick or raise Regan. Because I check the... so, so good. Check. Ha <laughs> ha! He's getting not, the... I'm not even the hand, the... Regan! Not even the hand! Syndicate! Syndicate store. Nah, yeah, I just wanted to clean it. Who so does seconds? I'm so tired. <laughs> Hold up. Yes, that says 3.30. The chips are packed away. Let's go on. The game is done. Who won? I'm so tired. Who won? I'm drinking now. Who nearly won? Mm, the FOMO. <laughs> <laughs> but I had you. I had you. Next, you. next minute? No, it's like yeah. Fast and the Furious A eh, where Vin Diesel says to Paul Walker, he's like, it doesn't matter if you have me by a metre or by a mile. Winning's winning. There mm. is no nearly. That's it, eh, bro? That that game that could have been fucking. I can I can say I nearly had Shark. I nearly had him, but it doesn't mean shit. See that calendar Unless... behind you, mate? Zoom up on that. Just dial it in. Just dial it in, bro. Yeah, mate.